Welcome, Welcome to Rocky, Rocky Railway Bible Adventure, Adventure December, December edition. edition. This month we are exploring how Jesus' power helps us be good friends. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus! Our Bible story this month is about Jesus' followers, his very first followers. After Jesus died and came back to life, he went back to heaven. His followers and friends told as many people as they could about Jesus. You heard a little bit about that with Peter and John's adventure last month. And then those people told people, and those people told people, and they told people, well, you get the picture. Pretty soon, lots of people believed in Jesus. Here's what it says in the Bible about those believers. It's in the book of Acts, chapter 2, verse 42. So they're eating together praising Jesus together, hanging out together, and sharing with each other. Wow, Jesus' power made those believers good friends, and they wanted everyone else to join them and become friends of Jesus too. Let's celebrate what we've learned about Jesus and his power these past few months so we can tell other people about it. Today, we are decorated for a party. We even have presents. <laughs> Each of these presents has a clue about something we learned during our time at Rocky Railway. <gasps> Yay, I get the first one. Okay. Do you remember the Bible story? Let's see. Let me get it out here. Do you remember the Bible story from our first month? Remember this? Can you see it? This was Ananias's, wasn't it? Ananias was so scared to talk to Saul, and this was part of his disguise. Nobody would recognize him. This disguise did not work well, but we said a prayer for him, and we helped him be brave so he could do the hard thing that he was too scared to do. Ananias did what God asked him to do. He talked to Saul, and Saul became Paul who became a follower of Jesus. All right, so... And this right here, this was our Bible memory buddy, Ramsey. He helps us to remember that Jesus' power helps us do hard things. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. Let's see what's in our second box. Ooh. Hmm. It's a ship's wheel. Do you remember what happened our second month? We went on a ship ride with prisoner Paul. That ride got rough. But Paul told us no one on the ship would die. Even though everything on the ship would be destroyed, he helped us have hope. Yep, and here's our day two memory buddy. This is Ava. And Ava reminds us Jesus' power gives us hope. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. Ooh, so let's see what's in our third box. What's in there? What's in there? Look at what I got. All right. There's coins in the box. Can you see the coins? There's coins in the box. What does this remind you of? It reminds me of the crippled man begging for coins outside the temple. Peter and John said they had no coins, but they had something better. They told the man to get up and walk. And he did. Peter and John went around telling everyone about Jesus and how their faith in him made the crippled man walk. They were very bold. Yes, they were. So our Bible memory buddy was Sierra. Sierra the mountain lion. And she reminds us that Jesus' power helps us be bold. Trust, Trust Jesus! Jesus. I wonder what's in our last box. Ooh. Oh, wow! A it's a balloon! Today, we are celebrating friendship. Jesus tells us to share our love to others. He wants us to be like a good friend to everyone. And our last Bible memory buddy is Lawrence Elk. And he reminds us that Jesus' power helps us to be good friends. 
Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. I'm so glad Jesus can help us be good friends. Share with whoever is with you one reason why you think they are a good friend. I think Alicia is a good friend because she's a good listener. And I think Mandy's a good friend because she makes me smile. <laughs> We are so glad you joined us in this YouTube journey. Have fun celebrating friendship this month. Bye, friends. Bye, friends.